Hello everybody, Derek here from Addictive Tips. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install the VNote Markdown Editor. So, we will be using the app image installation instructions, so let me get those open. Alright, so to start off, you're going to want to copy the download instruction link, the download link I should say, in the instructions. And this will allow you to get a copy of the app image right in your home folder, and you won't have to deal with your browser or any of that stuff. So let's go ahead and wait for that to download. All right, so once the app image is done downloading, we need to go and copy the make dir command, and this will allow us to create a new app image folder. And then we can simply move the app image for vnote into the folder, and then we need to update the file permissions of the app image, and that requires your password. Now once you do that, you can cd into the app images folder, and if you run the ls command, you'll see that this is green. Now it's green because the permissions are ready to go. So from here, we can run the vnote app for the first time, like so, and it should start it up right away. I'm going to close it again, though, just because I need to uh, do something. So you, so you can see that it's not just, you know me running it from the terminal. You can actually also open it up just by going to your home folder here. Let me get to that and then go to app image, double click on vnote and it'll open just like that. And then you have access to vnote. You can write your, all of your uh, markdown, whatever you'd like to do with this app. It's pretty nice. I don't know a lot about markdown. I use it sometimes, but uh, if you like Vim and all of that, this is definitely something you're going to want to check out. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you in the next one.